Welcome to Runway Academy. Today, we're exploring Gen 4 references. Gen 4 references allows you to visualize and create consistent characters and locations, new shots and angles, and so much more. All you need to do is open up a new session, click on the image tab, then drag in up to three reference images to use. For now, we'll just start with a single reference image of our character and work our way up from there. If you'd like to save your character into your library for a quick recall later, just hover over the reference image to give them a name. Now that image will appear in your saved references and can be called at any time using the at symbol and the name of the saved reference. With references, you can be very conversational with your prompts, like asking to see your character with a different style or in a new location. If you want to keep exploring a reference more, simply drag the output image into the references panel, then ask for something new, like a new angle of the scene, a close-up on a background element, or a new character to be introduced. Now let's move to two reference images and provide a location with our character. We can prompt for something simple like show me at character in the location description. Or we can get even more specific with direction, like show me a tight close-up of at character leaning against the back wall of the location description with a warm light illuminating the side of his face. With references, you can choose any part of the image to reference, including things like lighting, color grades, compositions, poses, and more. Try referencing different components of the images directly, saving tags for more specific names, or even just referencing image one or image two according to the upload order of your images. Reference images can be combined in an infinite number of ways to achieve stunning and coherent images that you can then turn into videos. As of today, References primarily supports character and location preservation, but we will be making future updates to support objects, styles, and more. We're excited to see what you make with References. Don't forget to check out the help article if you want some additional tips and tricks. You can check out the Discord to see how our community members are using References or if you need to ask us a question directly, you can use this button on your dashboard at any time.